guys. So in today's video, it's gonna be all about my hair color. I have a lot of disclaimers. I am apologizing ahead of time for my background area. If it does look a little different, my actual bedroom has the best lighting in it. So I'm gonna try to just put some maybe lights or something in the background. And this may be my area where I'm filming at just for a little bit of time. And if I've been MIA, sometimes I may be gone for a week or two. It's really just because of my school schedule. So even before I just start talking about the color, the one thing I do want to address is your hair health to me personally is very important I make sure I try to take care of my body inside as much as I can so if you are thinking about bleaching your hair or dyeing your hair I do recommend having a really good health regimen if you're healthy inside then your hair is going to be healthy on the outside because everything with your body it works from the inside out so if you have a really good hair regimen if you are eating your greens and your fruits and your vegetables you're drinking a lot of water then you will have a lot of hair growth make sure that you don't shampoo your hair all the time shampoo strips your hair of moisture and if you have bleach in your hair any type of permanent dye that's something that you just want to stay away from the best thing that you want to do for your hair if it's dyed or if it's bleached you want to make sure that you are always co-washing in bleached hair you also want to make sure that you're staying away from any type of heat styling that's really really important just because your hair when your hair is bleached is already your cuticles in your hair is already weakened so if you're putting any type of harsh heat to the hair it will cause a lot of breakage so stay away from heat styling and if you do heat styling I recommend doing like a low tension blow dry method but nothing where you're just constantly putting heat on your hair all the time on a regular basis that is a no because that too is going to cause a lot of breakage to your hair and again you won't have any type of growth all right so I just wanted to clarify on a few questions that I get on Instagram and I get it a lot this one question I get tons of all the time the one question I always get is what color is your hair I don't have a certain color of my hair my hair is bleached so what that means is my hair color was lifted from the bleach what I did was I got my hair dyed professionally by a licensed cosmetologist and when she put the bleach on my hair I pretty much just let her know the color that I wanted the bleach to stop lifting my hair color too so that's it is pretty much like a custom type of color the brand that was used to dye my hair is from the brand ion that is a brand that is located at your local Sally's if you do have a Sally's if not I recommend just googling the name and you might be able to see for your area where can you get those products at but the brand name is called ion and how you spell it is I O N okay so let's talk about my regimen a co-wash once a week um, I never really have a set day normally my set day to co-wash is Saturdays and Sundays but for any reason if school and work just gets me wrapped up with my time then I'll normally do like a midday um, co-wash so who once or twice a week I co-wash once a week I deep condition once or twice a week that's really the only thing that's changed with my regimen I um, I make sure that if my hair for any reason feels extremely dry or if it feels drier than normal I'll just make sure that I'll deep condition once or twice if I need to do it three times which I don't but if I do I'll do that deep conditioning has really been beneficial for my bleached highlighted hair and something that I really never did before was protein treatments I never really stayed on top of my protein treatments before when I just had my natural hair color but since my hair is bleached I do make sure that I stay on top of my protein treatments I do not have the packet that I actually use but I use the brand Afoji and the stuff is amazing protein treatment is just like the protein that you eat for your body it is going to help strengthen your hair I do highly highly recommend getting a protein treatment if you are thinking about getting your hair bleached or if you already have your hair bleached you want to make sure that you're keeping on with your protein treatment you can also do DIYs I'm, I don't do a lot of the DIYs but you can use avocado you can use eggs you can use mayo you can make your own concoction and you can create your own type of protein mixture but I use the Afoji brand it works for me and I really like how my hair feels after I use it my hair feels really strong to go over a few products that I've been using and that I've been loving that I've tried for the first time and just a few products that I've already used okay so the first two products are going to be leave-in products 
Um, this is the Direct Leave-In Weightless Moisturizer Conditioner. This is a really great lightweight conditioner that my hair has been absolutely loving. I used this when I had a TWA in 2013, but the only problem with that was when I had a TWA, I really could not see how the product really worked for my hair. I didn't really get the full effect of it until now. So I just recently picked this up. I got it at Whole Foods and it was on sale, I think for $7 stuff is amazing. This is a holy grail product that I never want to be without. This is amazing for wash and goes. It literally is a lightweight moisturizing conditioner. It leaves my hair so soft, it leaves it moisturized. My oils tend to stay the same. I always use the Trader Joe's organic virgin coconut oil. This stuff makes my hair so soft. Um, to do my hair today, I co-washed and I just put this on. That's all that I use and this was pretty much just a moisture based for my leave-in. Um, and then I also used Argan Oil. This is the Mark Anthony Argan Oil of Morocco and I actually got this in an Ipsy bag. And Argan Oil works really, really well with my hair. I like oils that makes my hair really, really soft. So coconut oil and argan oil has been a holy grail for me since I've been natural. So what I do is I'll put my leave-in conditioner in, I use my oil, and then I'll use a gel or I'll use a cream or a butter just to seal in all the products that I have used on my hair. And again, I use the organic virgin coconut oil and I've been using the Mark Anthony Argan Oil of Morocco. So these are two products that are very new to me. These are products that I received in my Crowbox Natural box and I think that these are two phenomenal products. These are the Diva Curl No Poo Decadence Cleanse and this is the Diva Curl One Condition Decadence Condition and together they make the perfect pair. I got a really good deal from the Curlbox Natural line. It was a $90 value box and it's actually a $35 box plus a $5 shipping and I could not miss out on that deal because I've been wanting to try Diva Curl since I've been natural, since 2013, and I'm so happy that I picked these items up because this no poo cleanse is everything that your hair needs to make sure that it is cleansed, it hydrates your hair, it moisturizes, it's no lather, it's so easy to detangle with this, and I think the retail value for this bottle is $22. But the good thing about it is it's not a drying shampoo. It's a very hydrating shampoo. So this is a no poo decadence diva curl and it is the bomb. And then I went behind with the one condition decadence condition. And man, this, I didn't even use a lot. I didn't use a lot inside the bottle. This stuff, this slip is crazy. Now, this super cream is considered more, not of a leave-in to me. This is more of a styler. This stuff is really great as well. This is how I got my definition today is with this super cream, the Diva Curl Super Cream um, Coconut Styler. This is amazing. This hydrates your hair. This gives amazing clumpage. And I have been loving it with my newly bleached hair. One of the gels that I have been loving is the Miss Jessie's Jelly Soft Curls. I did a wash and go routine with this and I can't speak on this gel any more than I already do. It smells just detergent it it's, it's just everything it's everything in a bottle it's for wash and goes but you can use it for twist outs it makes my hair so soft no crunch it doesn't make it hard it just gives you super defined curls that last and this stuff's amazing I got it on sale at Target for $11 this is this is it this is I love it so this is what I've been using currently the condition is like life this is this is life for me this is the shea moisture manuka honey and referral oil intensive hydration hair mask this stuff is just it's literally heaven in a bottle it smells so good and this I never knew what a holy grail product was until I purchased this item and now I understand a holy grail item is an item that you can't be without I never want to be without this item this makes my hair so soft. Like I can't even say enough wonderful, wonderful things about this product. If you have not tried this deep conditioner, 
then I highly recommend go getting this. I got it at Target. I'm sure you can get this anywhere that Shea Moisture products are available, but this stuff makes my hair so freaking soft. It gives my hair so much moisture, like, I just can't explain it. It's just amazing. It's that amazing that I can't explain, but my bleached natural hair has been loving this item. And I just think everybody needs to go out and get this. So again, that is the Manuka Honey and Mephora Oil Intensive Hydration Hair Mask. And those are all the products that I've been using. That is my current regimen for my newly bleached hair. I hope that I answered all of you guys' questions. If I did not, just make sure you comment down below in the comment section. I will make sure that I will answer anything else that you guys have any questions about. I hope this video was very informative. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. I missed, I'll make sure that I will get to your question. Please subscribe to my videos if you no. With all of your questions, if you are not subscribing to my video, too legit, too legit to quit, hey, hey, please subscribe, please subscribe to my channel.